My name is Dave Jones and I work for Lightwear Visual Engineering and we're here at Infocom Middle East. It's, uh, it's the second time we've been to the Middle East and Infocom. We did the Palm Show before that for a couple of years and the market, the show is a lot slower than most of the other Infocom shows as in the amount of people that come but the type of people and the, the knowledge base of the people that come to the booth is actually very high so um, for us it's, it's an event that I think is going to be in the calendar every year and we're, we're very happy with, uh, with the response of that. Basically we, we have our head offices in Hungary in Budapest and then we have multiple regional offices around the world. So we have a lightweight like, Italy for example and, and other lightweight like, offices. Um, in the Middle East we manage that from the head office in Budapest so we have a sales team in Hungary that will help the integration in, in the so we would sell to system integrators from, from Hungary, from Budapest. One of the products that we are um, showing here is the basically is to do with 4K. So I think everybody has probably heard of 4K and UHD. It's one of the, the big buzzwords at the moment. Um, so ultra high definition is a format that is based around the HDMI 1.4 specification. Uh, basically, we're talking about very high resolution, so 3,800. 140 by 2160, usually at 24 or 30 hertz at the moment as things stand. Um, and we're very fortunate that, that most lightwear products can support 4K resolutions. There's very few manufacturers in, in, in competition with us that are able to support these high resolutions at the moment. Um, and the product that I wanted to show you today is our um, MX series products, which are modular matrix frames. The idea is that you pick a chassis size, anything from 8x8 up to 160 by 160, and then you can pick input and output boards. The boards we're showing here are what we call TPS. Um, TPS stands for Twisted Pair Single. It's in essence based around HD Base T, for those of you that know the HD Base T technology. Um, the idea is that we can send video, um, audio and control over, plus power as well, over a single cat cable up to 150 to 180 meters um, from the source. So the concept of our input and output boards is that you have transmission boxes in the source, a single cat into the matrix, a single cat out of the matrix to receive boxes at the display. The idea being it gives you as few boxes as possible from one end of the system to the other end of the system and that obviously increases the chances of having a, a successful install. So as I say, we're running 3840 by 2160 on, on screen um, and our control software shows that the resolution is, is very high at 30, 30 hertz refresh rate and um, one other very cool feature of these cards is a cable diagnostics tool. So a lot of your readers will know that installing um, digital systems with category cable can be very difficult. If you get the wrong category cable or if it's um, not correctly installed then you can have lots of, of signal degradation issues. Well, one of our diagnostic tools in the, in the matrix control software shows how many errors you're receiving on that category cable. So if you're trying to run diagnostics, if everything is, is okay, is in the green section of our diagnostics, then your cable should be fine and your signal path should be fine and you should get a picture from end to end.